Hello YouTube, Nick here from MyGuyFilm.com. This video is going to be a theme review and this is a very uh, well worth purchase of a theme. I know I give you a lot of theme reviews and maybe some of you don't agree with paying for packages on Cydia because maybe you think jailbreaking is the way to get free things. We totally disagree with that but that obviously you're allowed your own opinion but this is a theme that I think you really should purchase guys. Um, it's really not worth getting a cracked version. Um, if you have any place in your heart, then you will buy this theme. Now, the reason I say that is because this theme is E is for Ezra. Now, basically, I'm not going to go into a lot of detail because I don't think it's right for me to talk about it. Um, but E is for Ezra. This is basically a theme where a bunch of theme creators, theme developers, have come together to make a theme to raise money for a um, charity. Now, this charity was set up by... Um, Kyle Matthews and his wife. Um, they uh, Kyle Matthews is basically the person who runs Mod My Eye. Now his son um, Ezra Ezra Matthews he sadly passed away with um, after losing out it, on his battle with cancer. So obviously, guys, this is a very very touching sort of topic, and I don't want to get into it. But all the necessary links. Um, like for the charity website and everything like that will be in the description so you can read much more about it if you want to so I don't really want to get into all of that I don't think it's right but I want to show you the theme and obviously it is a great theme guys so that's what we're really here to um, see we don't want to get into all of that um, again that's for you to go and read on but it is a very well worth cause guys and let's get into the theme itself so as you can see guys, if you go into your Cydia application, you type in E is for Ezra, and there's going to be quite a few things that you'll be able to find. So there will be the theme itself in HD and in SD, so for the non retina display devices, so the, the older devices, you can download that theme. There's also an animated lock screen, there's loading screens, SB settings, and another lock screen down the bottom as well. So as you can see, I've purchased it um, again definitely worth purchasing this theme and it's only I believe it's something like 2 dollars I'm not sure I'll put that put that on the um, uh, on the video so you can see the actual price but um, this is definitely a well worth cause so um, E is for Ezra you can find it in Cydia and um, all the necessary things like loading screens I'll show you that in the video I'll show you SB settings and I'll show you the lock screen as well um, so let's exit out of Cydia now and I'll show you the lock screen straight away so as you can see this is the uh, special animated lock screen if it loads up just let it load up and basically this just runs through pictures and things like that animated pictures on your lock screen um, that are to do with the cores basically so and also the words you will see on here all include that E which is a really nice feature for the E is for Ezra so you have the love and that picture there and then we've had live and we've had we get this one right here which is life and just a uh, very meaning sort of lock screen it goes really well with the cores. You do also have the time down here at the bottom and the date and it is a tap to unlock so if you tap it will bring up your passcode or simply unlock your device and we can get into the theme itself. So as you can see um, at the moment there's no sort of widget on the lock, um, the springboard but that's alright it looks fine as it is so the icons are really nice basically there's just sort of a grey sort of background with a bit of blue to it they look really simple really nice but they work really well with the theme itself as you can see down here on the springboard you do have that E again for E is for Ezra and on the springboard wallpaper you do get that sort of nice sort of gradient um, not gradient like honeycomb sort of design that looks really good it looks like it's under the wallpaper itself so really good attention to detail with just the wallpaper and the icons um, so that's pretty much a close-up look of the springboard itself as you can see the folders are also themed and every icon and also does include an icon mask so all your apps or applications will be themed as well to go really nicely with this theme so that was just a close sort of look up, look at the springboard. So you can see a nice reflection on the dock, and um, the page dots are also themed. The SB settings theme, as you can see right here in front of you, that is also themed again. That's a separate package to the theme itself, but it is free. So just go and download it in Cydia, 
and you can have the SB settings themed on your device. But the icons are very similar, uh, nice sort of blue glow to them, just works really well when it's on, it's green, when it's off they are red, as you can see them two there are red and the rest are green. So that's really nice, some buttons down here, they are also slightly themed and that's pretty much everything to the SB settings theme itself. So as you can see the phone application, the keypad for the phone application is nicely themed. You have that similar wallpaper you see on the springboard and the um, icons for the numbers, the, the actual keypad itself is also themed along with the box at the top. So when you click on it, you do get a sort of blue highlight as you can see right there and that's really nice to see. Um, also the icons down here at the bottom are also themed and the toolbar is slightly changed, nothing major but it again is very, is very well um, themed. So if we go to the messages application, um, the messages is also themed, you have a different um, message bubble and um, that's grey and a nice sort of wallpaper. You also do have the toolbar down here at the bottom so for the camera, um, the camera icon is also changed and the pop-ups like this are also themed and you'll find that in all the applications which include then pop-ups. So that's pretty much that, all the message um, buttons and the all, everything on the toolbars, the buttons, they are all nicely themed as always with these paid themes nowadays. So let's X out of the message application and if I just bring you to the App Store you can see the loading screens are again a separate package and I want to show you something really nice on this theme. If I just um, load up the App Store again you can see that loader, that was really nice um, really s sweet looking loader as you can see um, so that's a really nice thing, I really like that a lot in this theme, that loader is really nice to see. But if we go to the App Store itself, as you can see that loader again, your toolbars, everything like that, theme nicely in the same colour scheme. And that's pretty much the App Store, um, nothing really major, but it's really nice to have all these small attention to detail. So if we go to the iPod, Again, loan screen again, a separate application, a uh, separate download. Sorry, Insidia, and um, that's that. So if I just go to now playing again, all the toolbars, everything like that. But you can see really nice attention to detail. You have that similar wallpaper in the background um, of that honeycomb design. You might not be able to see it, but it is there, guys. And you do have this nice sort of loop um, music controls down here at the bottom with your set, your themed. Um, music controls itself so your volume control your play and pause and your skip tracks and everything like that so that's all nicely themed um, again really nice to have that part of the theme itself so we exit out the iPod um, I'll just go into Safari again another nice loading screen if we click down on there and we just load up um, we'll go to my bookmarks and we'll just load up migrateiphone.com as you can see the loader is nicely themed and again, if you see in the status bar, you do have that nice loader I was talking about earlier. Also, all the icons in the status bar and your signal, your Wi-Fi, your battery, everything like that is nicely themed in the same colour scheme. So, you saw the loader, you can see the, tool, the actual bar at the top of Safari. Again, it's slightly changed. Nothing major again, but it looks really nice. And like I said about the pop-ups, they are all themed to work well with the Ears for Ezra theme. So that's that, um, nothing really more I want to show you guys, it is a really great theme, if I go to the multitasking bar as you can see down here at the bottom, you do have that wallpaper, now you probably will need um, FS wipe cache to get the wallpaper on your multitasking bar and obviously in your folders, um, but that's very easy to download from Cydia if you want to do that, but you do have the background and if we go along you do have the buttons as well that you want, it, uh, they are also themed as well, so that's really nice to see. Um, and that's the multitasking bar guys so that's that again like I said the folders if I go to the folder you do have the same wallpaper so that's pretty much everything guys um, it's a really great theme obviously you can expect that from a bunch of theme developers that themselves have made great themes and they've all joined up to make this one theme so you can expect a really good guys, theme guys really well worth cause um, again all the links and if you want to read up on the story and everything are in the description down below and um, that's pretty much it. So it's Nick here from migrateiphone.com showing it, showing the E is for Ezra theme. Um, condolences go out to the Matthews family, and they do a great job over at Mob My Eye. So big props to them to keep that going and everything like that. So that's pretty much it. 
links again in the description and I'll see you all in the next video. Sorry for all them pop-ups, but you can see the pop-ups are also themed nicely. So, not done on purpose, but you know. And I'll catch you all in the next video. I'm going to stop rambling and um, that's pretty much it. So, see you later.